Hello friends, good morning. In my last video, you have learned about the direct online starters. Now I will we'll be explaining about the star delta starter. So in this, this is the star delta starter circuit. So when are the electrical circuit, they, they are always in de-energized condition. So now when we start tracing the circuit, so we can say these are de-energized condition, these contacts are open, these are open, these are open, these are de-energized, this de-energized, this de-energized, this de-energized, this, de this contact open, this is open, this is open, and these are too closed. Okay. Now 440 volt coming from here and waiting at these two places. Now through step down transformer, the power is given to the 220 volt to the control circuit. Now whatever, when you push the start push button, your power coming from here through this, through the K1T timer. This is the timer, timer starts. So timer is starting at is counting timing. So it is set to around 7 to 8 seconds. So now the power coming from here to this place and it finds circuit through this K1T, normally close contact, through this KM1. So KM1 makes, KM1 coil energized. So KM1 makes, KM does operation like make these contacts and complete for the star circuit then km1 this gets open and this makes so the this is energized so only star we made then power through this through this km1 to this km3 gets another main contactor here those contactor mean when this is contact is made your motor starts rotating it's running and km3 energized so your km3 contact makes and km3 contact makes. so when you leave the start push button so it doesn't matter because the power coming through this, through KM3 contact to this contact and this contact and your KM3 is So your motor starts running the star circuit. Okay. So your star circuit is made, KM1 main contactor is made and star circuit is made. So when KM1 energizes, it ensures that KM1 breaks. So this is the electrical interlock for the KM2. So your delta contact is not, not making. Okay. So your motor is starting at reduced voltage. Now, after say 7 to 8 seconds, your K1T gets uh, change over the contacts. When it is changing over contact, this contact change over, this gets open, and this may this open, this is gets closed. So when this is open, your this KM1 will get de-energized and K1T will make, and when this is getting energized, KM1 will also make. So your delta circuit is ready. So that power from here through this, through this and through KM2, it will uh, uh, complete circuit to the delta. So now your star is broken, now KM3 and KM2 two are energized and the power coming through this, through delta circuit, the circuit is completed. Okay. So now this is the electrical interlock, so KM2 energized, it breaks KM2 ensuring that KM1 is not getting energized. So your Circuit keeps on coming through this, through this, through this, this is made, through this, this is made and your motor is, uh, keeps on running.